fun hello my little bunnies today I wanted to show you this super cute uh, pink Nintendo switch purse by Netty cat pins and it's actually an Eda bag oh my gosh so I have already customized mine a little bit see my little Kirby's and whatnot and all my pins um, but this bag is so cute I want to show you guys because I know a lot of um, my subscribers like pink and Nintendo things and just cute stuff so I thought it would be cute to show it off so I got this just a little bit ago I've been making I've been meaning to make this video for a while and I'm actually also gonna do an um, IGTV of me decorating it with my pins but yeah so let me show you so here is the bag itself so cute. Um, there's also a Game Boy option, but I am personally a big Nintendo Switch fan, so I wanted the pink Nintendo Switch. It also comes in purple and I think black as well. I'm pretty sure. So like a lavender and a black. Um, if pink isn't your thing, <laughs> but I think a lot of my subscribers also like pink like me. So I put a lot of pins in here. I have some um, Marvel and DC pins in here. My favorite Iron Man pin. Oh, I love that one. And I love um, the fact that with Eda bags you can customize it, but there's no risk of your pins just flying off and being lost forever. So, yeah. And um, so this is the front. It does come with a little carrier, or it can be like a crossbody. I usually wear my bags crossbody. Um, also, just a cute little detail are the little zippers or little hearts. We love that. Um, and I've also got this keychain on here. This is from Modern and Geek on Instagram and Etsy. And it's like, it's hard to see here, but it's so sparkly and pretty in pink. So support them. They're a very small business. Um, and then on this side, I have my two flinging around Kirby's. Um, this Kirby I got from GameStop, GameStop, what? Uh, I can't talk. It sounded like I said GameStop, I think. <laughs> but I got this from GameStop a while back and I, he looks kind of funny because of the seams, but he's just so funny and cute. I had to get him because he's like, bloop, 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 you know, the flying Kirby. And then we have this Kirby that came from my band Presto box, which I have an unboxing of on my channel. And then um, there's a larger window on the back in case you want to display more things. So in here I have a pin from Hello Kitty Cafe, um, some random pins I have. I have two little Kirby keychains that are, they're just down there right now because <laughs> I don't want to put them on the outside in case they get lost. Um, so I might have to figure out a way to have them higher up. And then I have this Kirby. That's also a keychain, um, but he sits perfect there and he also doesn't get dirty because those keychains can get kind of, you know, dirty looking easily. We have Link right there. Yeah, cute stuff. Um, so this bag has some nice compartments. Like it might not look that big. I don't know how it um, will be perceived um, in the video, but it's got some good compartments in here. Okay, so, well, what I'm unzipping is the first compartment, which is the Eda bag. There's also this one. So, the middle compartment, both the outer ones are for the pins, um, which the inserts actually come separately. Um, that's maybe the only critique I would have. I would like if they come together, but hey, some people might want to mix and match. They might not want pink on pink or whatever. So, maybe it's better that way. <laughs> um, so, inside, the main compartment of the bag you do have this one part that is velcro and you can put things in here so like games or makeup um, all that kind of stuff um, then you also on this side have a zipper compartment that you can put things in and then of course just the main pocket and you could still store stuff like in here like there's plenty of room behind the actual like eat a bag inserts with all your pins on them 
especially if you're not using one of the sides, but yeah, you can still fit a ton in there, in my opinion. And then I also wanted to show you guys, because this is awesome to me. Um, you know, sometimes I like to travel with my Nintendo Switch, but you know, the Switch cases can be a bit bulky and you know, I like to travel very cute. You know, I like all things cute, you know, hence this and my whole pink kawaii setup, you know? So I want to let you guys know that with this bag, you can fit your Switch case in here. Like, and by the way, this case is from Omo Skins, in case you are wondering, but you can fit your whole case in here very easily. You could still fit some other stuff in the bag with it. It doesn't have to be just that. And bam, like, how cute, how cute. My pink switch in, Inside the pink carrying case inside this pink switch bag and it's not like it doesn't feel bulky at all so I'm not like oh my gosh my whole switch is in here um and they did say you could put your switch in there um they actually the creator Nettie Cat Pins they made it big enough for a switch hard shell case um and it is recommended that you have it inside a hard shell case so it doesn't get damaged because this isn't meant to be a protective bag it's just a cute bag but the fact that you can fit your whole switch case in there, it's a must. And it is like, I love that feature, honestly. Cause no one wants to carry around maybe just this on its own. That'd be kind of weird. I don't know. It's just my personal preference. Or, you know, maybe you don't want to carry around a whole backpack that day. So you could carry your little cute bag and have your switch in there and protect it. I love that. <laughs> Honestly, I don't really have critiques on this bag. Like I said, the only thing I think is that the insert inserts could come with the bag. Um, cause I actually made a separate order cause I'm stupid and I didn't, um, think about it coming separate, but honestly, it's okay. It's not that big of a deal, honestly. Um, so overall, I can't say I really have any issues. Um, this part of the bag is made out of canvas type of material, so the bag is more durable. And then this is like a pleather material, but it's just, it's so adorable. And the little freaking hearts and got me messed up. It's so cute. And it's just so fun. This is my first Eda bag. It's so fun accessorizing it and I love it. So I just wanted to do a quick review on this. Also, sorry, I kind of feel like I've been talking at a million miles an hour. So, I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. Be sure to hop on that like button and subscribe to join our little bunny fluffle. Thank you so much. Bye.